Scandinavian flick is a rally car move that involves sliding the bike the wrong way into a corner, gripping and then sliding the right way. Yeah, it's almost unnatural the way that the bike slides the opposite way away from the turn. However, when you feel that grip, the force will then push you back the opposite way and you'll be able to rail that turn. It's like a high side on a motorbike. The Scandinavian flick is a lot of fun and can be useful in some rare switchbacks, but I would say it goes down as a trick that probably isn't the fastest way of getting around the turn. It works well on corners that have a lot of grip or a bank of some sort on the inside of the turn. You can use this to push the back wheel into and then it should get fired back around the other way. Find yourself a suitable turn, quite tight on the inside but with plenty of grip. You're going to have to get the rear wheel sliding, so make sure that you're comfortable with that and that you're not going to panic. We've already done a video on how to drift, so check this out for our top tips. Also, pick the trail wisely. You don't want to go about ripping someone's fresh trails up. I don't think they would be too happy. On the entrance to the corner, you want to break the rear tyre loose towards the turn, either by applying too much rear brake or being aggressive with your cornering input. Bringing your weight slightly forward should help get the rear wheel sliding. Keep your weight above the bike but let your feet go with the back end. Try to predict the point of grip and make sure you aren't on the rear brake anymore. When the rear wheel grips or hits the bank, get ready to muscle the back wheel back around using your feet and get it back underneath you. Turn the bars into the corner, look through the corner and get ready to drop your outside pedal and dip the bike into the turn, keeping your weight low into the outside. Get comfortable to getting that back wheel sliding around, then you must come off the brakes and really commit to getting that back wheel sliding. Yeah, it's loads of fun, so just get out in the woods and have a go at it. If you want to improve any other aspects of your cornering, why not click up there to see how to lean the bike over in the corners? And click down there for how to drift. Click in the middle to subscribe. Give us a thumbs up if you like the Scandinavian drift.